All right, hey, so I'm off. Let's go get some punch keys. Some gluten-free punch keys. That's not an easy task. So they're for my son, who just loves to eat donuts. And especially this time of year, since tomorrow is Fat Tuesday, all of us Catholics know that Fat Tuesday falls the day before Lent. So got to get those gluten-free punch keys for him. So let's go. Let's go hit it. Hey, this is Dan with Puts Ponds and Gardens. Thanks for tuning in. This is my channel, Puts Ponds and Gardens. You know, the things that we do for our kids, you know what? We love them so much, but you know what? If it brings them a little bit of joy, that's all that matters, isn't it? What's really ironic is there used to be a gluten-free bakery within a mile of our house when we first moved in 17 years ago, and now they're, they moved a few miles away, quite a few miles away, but again, it's worth it, and you can have this one little treat, then it'll bring a smile to his face. So we're on our way. Gluten-free specialties. Rochester Hills, Michigan. And here we are at Celiac Specialties up here in Rochester Hills, Michigan. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, look at those bad boys in there. All kinds of punch keys. Got racks full of them. They've got all kinds of breads and muffins, specifically gluten-free. They've got gluten-free breadcrumbs, more you can do uh, use these for hamburger buns. They've got stuffing mixes. Some of our favorites are mozzarella cheese sticks. We've got pizza dough, soups, mac and cheese, and like a, a, a full lasagna dinner up in here. Some some gravies up on top here. And a couple little coconut smiles. All kinds of things that you don't think of, but someone with celiac disease can't have day-to-day -day items that everybody else can have. So I know what some of you guys are thinking, you know, what is this punch key? What do you mean by punch key? I never heard of these things before in my life. Well, I'm not sure how popular they are in other parts of the country, but here in Detroit, you know, punch key day or Fat Tuesday, as we Catholics like to call it, is it's almost like a national holiday. Bakeries are lined up out the door. People are getting to these bakeries super early. It's almost like buying a concert ticket when you were a teenager, you know, waiting outside in long lines overnight um, trying to get tickets for your favorite concert. But people line up outside the doors in some of these famous bakeries, or even not so famous bakeries, and they want to get a dozen donuts. Whether they're jelly filled, whether they are um, custard filled, but they are just jam packed with nothing but nothing good for you. <laughs> Listen, it's a fat donut, and I love them. My son loves them. My wife loves them, and you know what? We're going to celebrate Punchki Day, and eh, we still do the same thing every day. We don't buy each other cards or anything for Fat Tuesday or Punchki Day, but let, let me tell you, these things are nothing but...
pure goodness. All right, so if you haven't guessed this by now, this vlog has absolutely zero, zero, zero things to do with ponds. And it's all about Fat Tuesday. Ah. All right, so here's the punch keys. We got a dozen Bavarian cream chocolate frosting. We've got lemon with uh, lemon. Pow powdered sugar on top. Lemon. And we've got Bavarian cream with a glaze on top. Tomorrow is, what's it called? Punch key day. Yay.